There are two types of bell peppers, and each one has a correct way to cut it, and an infinite number of incorrect ways. Murphy and I are going to show you the right way to do it. Bell pepper is either going to have three lobes on the bottom, or more commonly, it will have four lobes on the bottom. If you see a bell pepper that has any more or less lobes than that, get rid of it. Do not eat that bell pepper. Beginning with a three-lobed pepper, if your pepper has a stem that protrudes out of the top, just slice it off and put your knife right on one of the lobes and then slice around. If you can see, they sliced in a curve like that. And what I'm doing is I'm getting around this disgusting white pithy part inside. And the final one. My four lobed pepper is going to be the special treat and after you see this you're going to probably never buy anything that doesn't have four lobes again. Watch this. We're going to go between two of the lobes, not on this creased part, but we're going to bisect the lobe itself and cut straight through all the way. Now you reach your fingers in and you're going to twist this part out like that. Don't pull it out twist it out. Watch. Twist it out. And there's your waist. Okay. The reason we went between the lobes like this is the part that I have to clean out is much easier to get to. If we had gone like this, then I would have a piece here and a piece here and a piece here and a piece here that I would have to get out. So you just pull that out and that's it. All of the rest of the pepper is usable, every bit of it. And now just like usual, Healthy food is cheaper than junk food. My mission is to prove it and get you eating healthy. My name is Mike, and this is the Vegetable Chopping Channel.